I'm Eddie from Chopped and today I'm going to show you how to chop vegetables safely and well. First thing you need is a chopping board and a good tip is always put a damp cloth underneath your chopping board, put it on top so then it's much more sticky on the table so it's not going to move. Next thing is obviously take your clean vegetables. The most important thing is a knife, is a sharp knife. The sharper the knife, the safer it is. If you've got a blunt knife, you're going to use more effort to try and push it through whatever you're cutting. Therefore, your effort is in pushing, not in chopping, it's more dangerous. So the way I chop a pepper is to work down the sides first, like that. So you're keeping all the gubbins inside, and then just cut through there. And then you've got all your waste in one go. You've got no waste on your chopping board. And then with chopping, it's all about safety rather than speed. So try and get your hands in a claw, put your hand on there, you put, you're using that knuckle against the knife as you guide. And then you're not chopping, you're actually slicing. And if you notice, the knife does not leave the board. This part of the knife is actually doing that. It's rocking, it's not chopping. If you try to chop something, it doesn't go the right way through. But if you slice it, again, chop, take it slowly. All you're doing is working your knife through. You notice that my knife is only just above what I'm cutting. Do that again slowly. The knife rocks and you see my fingers crouched like I'm trying to hold a little ping pong ball or something. If you do it like that, you will not cut yourself and you'll get a good cut vegetable. So that's all it is. Remember, sharp knife, board that doesn't move, wash your veg, take it slowly. And that's it. Easy.